you guys welcome back to the channel so guys today we're gonna be back on the topic of 77 barry so i did actually make a video on him a, a couple of days ago guys but now he has actually gone ahead and deleted the video where he was basically just crying because of his setup and his dad was abusing him and recently on twitter and on his community tabs and also he, he has been making a couple of streams and everything guys there's been so many updates guys of like a lot of people exposing him from twitter because he's actually been going ahead and making videos just saying that he's okay making tweets that saying he's okay and they're gonna have to stop worrying about him so he did actually make a video by the title of youtube thank you so much i'm okay now this actually does it's like seem a wee bit sketchy because he did make a last video of him crying and saying that he's not okay and everything guys saying he's been abused by his stepfather now i'm pretty sure that his stepfather probably did say that he was actually getting a lot of donations because everybody set up a GoFundMe, his Streamlabs donations and everything like that, guys. But also, what else is interesting is when he did actually go ahead and upload the video, he actually just posted a video, he, he pinned it, and then he deleted it straight after, guys. Look at this over here. So as it says, he said, I'm saying this as fast as possible than deleting this. I was forced to make this video and delete the last one. Now, he only had that up for about two minutes, guys. And then he deleted it so his stepdad wouldn't see it, guys. Now, he's actually trying to like point out some things that he's actually still being abused. He still needs some help and everything like that. But what else is actually interesting, guys? He actually did go ahead, delete that comment. And then he actually posted another comment, guys, about a couple hours later, stating... Why do people think I'm being held hostage? Literally, my dad just told me to delete it over the phone. So, that is that sounds really fake, guys, to be fair. And I don't know who would actually post that comment if they were actually being abused by their stepfather. This is another sign of abuse, guys. And I would 100% have to call the police on him. But I can't really do anything, guys. But we can actually go ahead and do something. I've actually... People have actually gone ahead and set up a GoFundMe. So, there's going to be one in the description, guys. Also... If users are having problems like this, there are actually some like hotlines on the internet or anything, guys. You can actually just go ahead and type them up. But also, guys, there's more stuff. He was actually doing a live stream, guys. So over here, he was actually doing a live stream. So that over here, guys, you can see that the whole chat is telling him to turn the camera around and everything. But he's not turning it around. It's almost like he's reading them, but he's just ignoring the whole message, guys. Now... I'm 100% sure that his stepdad is actually on the back of this because why would he just be doing this and yeah his stepdad is probably behind the camera and yeah that's why everybody in the chat was telling him to make, turn the camera around let them see it. I was on Twitter also and I was just scrolling around the 77 Barry stuff and guys it actually popped out and I actually just seen this video guys look over here. That's what it is. So, that video is actually pretty crazy because he coughed a couple seconds after that guy donated saying cough really hard if this is forced. Now, that's not a coincidence guys, like that's really not a coincidence if you think about it. But yeah, also there's actually more things guys. His friend actually made a 7 minute video saying the truth about 77 Barry. So, this is actually a 7 minute video guys, I'll link it down below in the description. So in this video he's basically, like if Barry's friend is basically saying that it's all like real and he doesn't really want to report it to the police or anything. But he probably did actually tell his friend just to do this. I'm sure that his stepdad did actually go ahead and tell Barry's friend just to make this video. But he was basically saying that if he does actually go ahead and call the police, his family's gonna crumble. Right now, he was also saying that he's living at his grandparents' houses and he doesn't really want his family to crumble because if this actually does happen, if he does actually go ahead and call the police on his stepdad, then that will actually make his whole family crumble, guys. So I'm pretty sure you do understand, guys. Now, I would understand as well, but I'm not 100% sure if this is too real, but yeah. Anyway guys, that is basically it from today's video guys. And don't forget, hashtag pray for 77 Barry. But yeah, anyway, I will leave a donation link down below in the description. I'll leave a video of his friend talking about him as well. But anyway guys, hope you enjoyed and I will see you in the next one. Peace out guys.